we're going to have uh, kids that's going to get an opportunity to go to college that one might not be able to or two it'll just help them uh, it's not a scholarship for need or it's not a scholarship because you're the best baseball player it's a character scholarship uh, for the kid that gives off the characteristics of Christ Riley had those characteristics he thought of others more than he thought of himself most of the time now he was a normal teenager but he thought of others more than uh, he thought of himself and it's just uh, awesome and uh, very humbling for our family that this event is even taking place. There's only one Friday left until teams take the field for the first action of the 2018 high school football season, but we still have more teams to get to before that. Up next on 21 teams in 21 days, we have a look at the Rutherford Rams. Second year head coach Lauren Tillman is liking where his team is at with five days of fall camps in the books, despite some wet weather over the past week. The Rams have a strong turnout this year with a little over 40 players at the varsity level, roughly 15 of them being seniors. The Rams quarterback Reggie Tubbs, Jonathan Proctor and Dylan Richardson were getting reps all spring and summer as well, and the three guys are still competing. But Tillman says Tubbs established himself as number one at FCA camp a few weeks ago. Tillman says the offense has its playmakers, but he has high expectations for the defense, which comes in with the most experience. We feel like that's probably going to be a strength early um, as the offensive line grows. Um, we lost uh, several seniors from the offensive line a year ago, and so it's going to probably take a little bit of game time for them to gel. Um, they've had a great summer, but it's still different than the game situation. So we feel like hopefully the defense is going to, you know, create a lot of stuff for us. There's a lot of speed on that side of the ball. And, uh, um, the boys actually, you know, like each other. And, and uh, so they, I think they play harder for each other. Yesterday we featured the North Bayhaven Buccaneers for 21 teams and there are no days off for this football program. Tonight they're cleaning up for a good cause. The Buccaneers teamed up with Coaches for Curing Cancer to host a charity dinner to raise money for cancer patients and cancer research. Legendary football coach the Bobby Bowden was the featured guest speaker. He says it's important to show support to kids in need. If they need all the help they can get. That's what, that's what life is about, really, is, is, is charity. You know, and it, used to be that, it used to be the way it was. When people were in need, other people took care of them. Now then, everybody's dependent upon uh, the government to do it. And it, takes, it takes the personal love out of it. The event also included a silent auction and raffles with prizes, such as a trip to Fiji.